Hey, what's happening, guys? Hey, last night I posted about how to Wi-Fi enable your garage door. So I went, I thought I'd like actually show it to you. So uh, I'm not going to be able to show you the app from the phone that we use. And don't judge me because all the spider webs and dust up here. But anyway, here it is. It's called the Sonoff 4-Channel Pro. They got two 4-Channel boxes. You want the 4-Channel Pro because it's got all your relay controls here, right? Like you got uh, common, normally open, normally close, right? And you got four different channels that you can use. The cool thing about this box, you can power it from 110, which is this plug right here, right? And that runs down and goes in to right here. And you can use 90 to 200 and something volts. Or you can do DC, 5 volts to 24 volts, which is kind of cool. This guy's just zip tied on here. And the way I wired this in, this wire right here, it's just two conductors. This is the guy that goes to your switch on your wall that you push to make the garage door either go up or stop in the middle or come back down. So this switch, when you push that switch on your wall, it takes the two contacts and closes them together. So I just wired that guy up down here on the common and normally open. I just cut and twisted the wires together, shoved them up in there. And then uh, whenever you engage this guy, either via your phone or via the, uh, the dot, right, which I brought the dot out here with us so I could show you that, uh, it'll make the garage door go up and down the same as you pushing the button. The other cool thing is this guy also supports 433 megahertz uh, remotes. So you can have this guy learn remotes. So you get like a little keychain remote for five bucks that goes on your keychain and you could operate your garage door all day long. So let's give this guy a test drive. Hopefully um, this little dot thing will understand me. So let's first do a base test. Alexa, what time is it? The time is 5.35 p.m. Awesome. Alexa, garage door on. Okay. Alexa, garage door on. And then it stops at okay. mid midway, just like you push the button. Alexa, garage door on. Okay. So there you go. There is the Sonoff 4 Channel Pro. This guy's like, I think it's $23. Uh, if you got real fancy, you could program some of these other ones to do other things. Uh, a few things to keep in mind when you set this box up, um, there's a timer setting that you can use, but it's one timed event for all the channels. So if you set it to a half a second depress or a contact closure, that's the same timer for all the buttons. Now you can pick like, I've got this one set, they call it inching mode, which is a timer mode. And then these guys are latching mode. Or you can switch it up and all that stuff. Uh, but the load on this guy is uh, 10 amps per contact. Uh, 2.4 gigahertz, only B, doesn't do the 5 gigahertz stuff. And then it also supports the 433 megahertz, which is really awesome. Oh, darn it. Because uh, the 433 megahertz, if you want to get like a little keychain remote, to do your garage door or something, they're like five bucks. Uh, a lot cheaper than the traditional Craftsman and uh, what do they call them, the Genie, the Genie uh, garage door opener. So anyway, there it is. This guy was like, I don't know, 22, 25, $29, depending on where you get it from. Uh, took me maybe 15 minutes to get this installed, another 15 minutes to uh, unscrew it and set all the dip switches inside and read the manual. And then probably another 15 minutes to set up the apps on all the phones. So now that we got this guy set up, we can still use our old garage door opener. We can push the button on the wall. We can use the apps on our phone. Or we can use Alexa. Sweet. Alexa, what time is it? It's 5.37 p.m. Awesome. Alexa, tell me a joke. Why does Waldo always wear stripes? Because he doesn't want to be spotted. <laughs> Alexa, tell me about poop. I haven't been equipped to do that. Alexa, tell me about farts. I've never ever broken wind. <laughs> All right, guys. Anyway, see ya. Sonoff, 4 Channel Pro. Buy it. It's wonderful. It's awesome. I don't own, own stock in the company, but if they become publicly traded, I will probably do so. Also, 
They sell inline guys that'll uh, make a light or any 110 outlet, Wi-Fi enabled, and they're only like $5, which is awesome. And they integrate with Alexa in your phone and all that stuff. Anyway, peace. See ya.